It looks a great college football game to watch. The trophy presentation is coming up. The MVP in today's ball game. Ah, uh, you want to know who it is? I'm standing alongside his proud daddy, quarterback Brian Greasy of Michigan. What a year he's had. Changed his whole life. You got lost, me. <laughs> I don't blame you. You want to cry, you go ahead. I'll hold you up. That's Shea Greasy. You guys got me crying. <laughs> There's a lot here. A lot of good stuff right there. Earned everything he got, too. So did he, the man in the white shirt. The man who asked him to come on back and help us one more year. And that man right there, Woodson, and Steele, and William, and Remus. Lloyd Carr is now fully acclaimed as a football coach. Here's Vince yeah. one. Thank you very much, Keith. We're on the field with the president, Gary Dorn, of the Tournament of Roses Parade. He is going to make the trophy presentation. Coach, on behalf of the Tournament Roses Association, we want to award you the championship trophy, which is right here. Are we gonna pick it up? Yeah. Take it. 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 Take 50 years ago, the University of Michigan won the national championship in this stadium. And this is a dream. It's been a wonderful season. I want to thank our players, and our coaches, the great Michigan fans. We're just happy to be a great Washington yeah. State team. Uh, it went right down to the wire just like we thought it would. But. Uh, we got something to celebrate now. You got a lot to celebrate. We're going to make another presentation. The man behind you, your quarterback, number 14, Brian Greasy. Brian, step forward. Congratulations to you, MVP of the Rose Bowl game. Lord, you have a question. Did his old man ever win this trophy? <laughs> he did. I knew that was coming. <laughs> no, but he kept two extra points to win a game here. Well, like father, like son, Brian, congratulations. Uh, it's an unbelievable feeling. I'm happy for this team, for these fans, for our university. It's an unbelievable feeling. Brian, this is a long journey for you. You were a walk-on at the University of Michigan. You had a decision to make. You came back for a fifth year. Need I say it's worth it? I couldn't have dreamed any, any better ending to my career here. I just feel so humble to be up here with all my, my players and for the fans. I'm just glad I came back and I could contribute. In the course of this ball game, it seemed like they were challenging you to throw the ball deep against their defense. Your receivers came through for you, an outstanding performance. They did. Every guy on that offense was called out. And our defense was playing a great game, and when it was up to us to win the game, our offensive line, Ty Streets, Russell Shaw, those guys did an unbelievable job. Now, I'm going to ask Charles Woodson to come forward here. He's standing here in the background. Michigan fans, baby. Not yet. Not yet. You'll hear it soon enough. A remarkable performance. One of the things that 
that marked this season is that you played your best in the big ball games. You gave another great performance. Well, I take pride in that. Uh, trying to come out this last game of the season, we had a chance for it all. And it just wasn't me out there today. It was a whole bunch of guys, a whole Michigan Wolverine team, and all the fans that made it down here to Pasadena. We did it, baby. We did it.